Hey guys, welcome back to All About Android. Today I have bought best apps of the month of September that's really going to improve your Android experience. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So the first app is called Tap Tap, with a port of double tap on the back device gesture from the Android 11 to any Android devices. It allows you to use the gesture to launch app, control the device including taking screenshot and toggle flashlight, open your assistance and more. You can customize the action you wanna perform with this application as well. It's not available in the Play Store right now but you can download it from the XTA forum. The second app is called TrueAmp. If you are bored with the charging animation of your phone and want to customize it, then you should give it a try. There are only 5 variations to choose from, but one of them is free and also you can customize them as per your likings. But the drawback is, most of the features are only available in the paid version, but still you can give it a try for once. Next application is Unlock Clock. As the name suggests, it shows the number of times you have unlocked the phone in the wallpaper, which looks really beautiful in my opinion. It helps you to know how addicted you are to your phone and also represents that in an elegant way. Also, you can customize it as per your liking to make it look more unique as per your choice. The next app is a KWGT theme named Saturn KWGT. There are total 80 presets available right now in it. It's rare to find so many beautiful presets in a single KWGT theme that is free as well. The presets are well made and goes with any kind of screen that you can see here. You can also customize the color of these presets and make them go with your setup. So, I would definitely recommend you to give it a try. Last but not the least, we have our last application which is called TruePix. It's a whole package of customization. There are different categories to choose from where you can find beautiful setups and wallpaper as well. You can get the idea about new home screens and also get the backup files required for the setup and all the things required to replicate that home screen. It's definitely recommended to you if you like to customize your phone quite often like me. So that's all for today, if you have any suggestion for new video or anything you can comment down below, I will definitely try that out. See you soon in my next video, stay safe, peace out.